Rich, how are we looking weather-wise today? I'm peeking out uh, the forecast for next week, and I'm seeing some heat coming a little bit here. It is. Yeah, it's northwest heat. I mean, it's kind of like the average temperature during the summer in places like Texas. But, right. Yeah. <laughs> but actually, it's probably cool for them. They're putting on sweaters when it drops to 85 there yeah, in places yeah, like true. Houston. Not yeah. up here. Yeah, well, we, we are going to get through the weekend first. And we do have clouds out there. We have a couple of systems that are going to be passing through British Columbia over the next three days and giving us the clouds that we're kind of seeing off and on. Some sun's going to get through it each day. So they're partly sunny is the overall pattern. And then might see a couple of showers around tomorrow. Take a look out in Bellingham. We did have some sunshine sneaking through there earlier. but. Uh, uh, it does look like it's a fairly solid deck of clouds right now. Should thin back out again. It's just the, these little bands kind of moving through. Notice that the Lady Bahi, the older looking ship that had been sitting there for the last few days, but not an old ship, was commissioned in the early 2000s, uh, has disappeared. It must have headed out to sea. But maybe heading south to find more sunshine. Because the farther south you go, the more sun you're going to see. And Tacoma checking in with a little bit of sunshine sneaking through those clouds and reflecting off the Tacoma Dome this morning. Take a look at uh, the waterfront camera. A little bit thicker in Seattle, so we're not seeing quite as much get through there. And uh, Shorecrest High School and Shoreline. Time lapse really shows you what's going on as those kind of bands of clouds go through there. It goes from cloudy back to sunny and back. So partly, you could call it partly cloudy or partly sunny, depending on your outlook. I lean towards the sun side. Temperatures mostly in the low to mid 50s right now. They're starting to warm in a few places. Camino Island up to 60 degrees. Check in the satellite image. You can see this first band just kind of going through here, and that is going to move on through. We will see another one develop that's going to be moving in tomorrow. That one's going to come a little bit closer to us, giving some showers to the coast tomorrow morning. We might see a few showers into the Puget Sound uh, the interior areas mainly north of Seattle tomorrow. There won't be that many of them even there, so most places should get through Saturday dry. We'll be looking for things to start clearing out as we head towards Sunday, and then when high pressure builds in off from off the coast, that is going to settle us into a sunny and warm pattern with temperatures pushing into the mid-80s in a lot of places around midweek next week. So for today, though, overall partly sunny, temperatures in the low to mid-70s. Tomorrow about the same chance of a few showers mainly north of Seattle. And Cooling off a couple degrees, still a decent day. Sunday will warm back up a few degrees and start to clear out more in the afternoon. We look for sunshine Monday, upper 70s and low 80s. And then Tuesday through Thursday, look for low to mid 80s. And then we'll see it cool back to maybe around 80 degrees or so as we head towards Friday and even cooler as we head into the Labor Day weekend.